Hello everyone, welcome to Excel 10 tutorial. In this quick Excel tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can insert page number in Microsoft Excel. I will show you different ways to insert page number in Microsoft Excel. Let's get started. <laughs> Now, first, I would like to thank Ruin, Nicholas, and Susan for becoming Patreon on patreon.com slash excel10 tutorial. Thank you very much. Your support means a lot to me. Thank you. Now, if you want to support the channel like Ruin, Nicholas, and Susan, you can join our Patreon page, which is patreon.com slash excel10 tutorial. Link will be in the description. Please check that. And now, let's insert page number the first way i'm going to show you is click on the view tab and you can see here we are in the normal mode if i click page layout and now if i hover here you can see we have option to add header and if i scroll down we have option to add footer now usually we insert page number in either header or footer and you won't be able to see the page number until you are in page layout mode or you are printing your worksheet okay usually we use page number when we want to print it so in the footer we can add our page number and we can print it and when we print it the page number will be printed also if I click on the footer here you can see new tab has been opened which is design tab and under the header and footer tools okay now this tab only appears whenever you click on footer or header okay now take a look at here page number if I click here you can see this text has been pasted here and if if I click on anywhere of this worksheet you can see we have a hash because we don't have any text in any of this worksheet if we had text here let's write something here and click somewhere else so that means we have text in sheet 1 and now we have the page number automatically inserted here okay now let's click here again we have page number and now I want to add also total page number here okay so space and if I write off again Again, space and if I click on this design mode and you can see number of pages okay if I click here and you can see this text has been pasted if I click anywhere on the worksheet and you can see one out of one okay now if I write something in the next page you can see the page number has been changed it's the first page and here in the footer you can see two out of two so this is how you can insert page number okay now let's delete this click on view and go to the normal mode now how you can add page number in this section I'm going to add page number from the insert tab click on insert and here under the text section click here this drop down and if you click on header and footer we are moved to the same page we were before okay this is our header option click here and you can add page number and number of pages from here okay again page number and number of pages click anywhere and you can see it has been written automatically okay now remove it and go back to the normal view mode next option is to click on the page layout tab and under the page setup click on this arrow okay now this will open the page setup pop-up and you can click on header and footer okay and if you want to insert page number in header or in footer you can adjust it from here okay now if I click on the drop down and you can see page number one that means if you select this it will only show you the current page number Number, okay and if you select this format it will show you current page number and number of pages okay so there are different type of formatting here you can select it and I'm going to select this one so this is our header okay and if I click OK and if I go to the view and page layout option you can see our page number has been added so how we added it here page layout and page setup okay now there are different option here different first page if you have a first page that is different you can select it here first page header and footer will be different and different odd and even pages you can select that here okay if I click OK so this is how you can insert page number in Microsoft Excel this is what I wanted to show you thank you thanks for watching see you in the next tutorial and don't forget to subscribe if you can support the channel to patreon which is patreon.com slash excel 10 tutorial thank you thanks for watching